I just realized I didn't have all the SIM cards in from last night either because we've been working on the test setup for... I only got two more days. Uh, car. Uh, got a bunch of stuff and running around for us to do to make sure you not forget to go to the phone store, uh, cat cafe, some stuff kind of all around the same area, so I figured it'd be convenient for us to walk to a couple places. Last stream was 13 hour stream, long stream, without any breaks, so I did sleep in a little bit as a result. Today might be something similar, but then Saturday will need to be like early only. I can't go like late at night. So uh, I gotta be at the airport very, very, very early. So Saturday, probably just in the morning. Saturday, which is tomorrow, by the way. Gecko, not my bathroom anymore. He disappeared. Uh, I was gonna just like start outside, but let me grab some oatmeal first and then go anyway. Pad in the stomach. At least when we leave here, it won't be as hot, right? Um. It will be as hot. It's about the same. Over in the Bangkok. So, the only difference with Bangkok is that it's, um, what's the word? It's way more uh, built up, I guess is the word, built up. I mean, it has mega malls at every station, but not just that. There's just bigger stores and places everywhere, so there's more air conditioning. So it's it's easier to dip the heat when you can like go inside somewhere. And Vietnam doesn't have that as an option a whole lot. So that's why it feels hotter here. Thank you, Gemay. Thank you, Johnny Franks, for the resub. Oh, we can read through some Twitch news. There's actually a lot of stuff Twitch is working on right now. Just gonna have a tiny bit here. 112 Fahrenheit right now. Yeah. So, like, I'm okay when I'm inside. I'm okay right now. Just can't turn off the AC, but yeah, that's the point. Is you know, it, it's cool to go outside for like an hour, two hours. Uh, just not not longer than that without a break. No, no one does. Just can't. And that's my problem, is I'm, I'm used to staying outside. Regardless. But, uh, yesterday was fine. Barely, like we went outside, but we're barely outside at all. Other than one walk, day, one walk at night. That's heating up. Just having a banana, then we'll go. Probably be uh, that meant ride to Taoding near Bagel Cat Cafe over there. Maybe GTL sesh, they brought me back, phone store over there. Kind of everything I need. Someone's been knocking on my door for a while. I thought that was a stream loots code. <laughs> Shut 
Shogun Renewed. Um, yeah, they were they were in the talks for uh, season two, pretty much almost right away, like in the early negotiations and, and writing, because they have to like write it. Because I don't think there was anything left. But hearing them confirm not just a season two, but also a season three, dang, their uh, numbers must have impressed people to confirm two more seasons. That's huge. Feels like 44.4. Holy smokes. Yeah, okay. since the last 13 hour stream. Well, it, it, I've been up for a little bit, so it took an hour and a half to like figure out what we're doing today, tomorrow. Because uh, things are gonna start moving pretty quicker. We gotta uh, find some tin foil to complete building the stream setup today. So, got a, got a port on here. This HDMI port makes a pretty loose, weak, wobbly connection. So, I'm going to try some tin foil so that the cable won't move. That'll really work. I don't know if it'll fry up. I'm open to ideas if someone has a better idea. Rip Mary? Who's Mary? Shogun? Who's Mary? I thought people only cared about Moriko Mama Kui Yama Sama. And we're just calling her Mary for short. I don't think anyone that was gonna see season one has seen it by now, but maybe not. It is a little bit late to the game if you haven't, but that's okay. Check it out. Have you noticed there's a lot less bots in your viewer list on Twitch? As of yesterday, the number of channels unauthorized bots can lurk in is down to 100. So uh, over time, Every month they've been limiting harder. Um, and there's even more steps in the months to come. So that's interesting.
I don't know how that will affect my bagel bot. I don't think he's a verified bot. There's something to do with like join limits as well. So, um, I might have to research how to get a verified bot. Maybe not possible. The Twitch app has more changes, yeah. Uh, GTA 6 is confirmed for fall of 2025. Twitch is ending support for Twitch Studio on May 30th. So, in like a week and a half. It's sort of like an OBS um, streaming application for your computer but it's supposed to be more like straightforward with less options so that newbies can get into streaming. Twitch is shutting the app down, stating only 4% of streamer hours are broadcast through it. So add that to the graveyard. Um, anything that isn't directly making Twitch money by the masses, they are shutting down or closing completely, uh, even though it doesn't seem like it costs them anything just to have it there, but that's what they're doing for everything across the board. Not, not a monetized tool. So, they don't want to support it. a big one. Twitch, I posted this on Discord. Twitch will now allow twerking and shaking butt emotes again. Dang. That used to be huge drama ordeal, dude. I think, uh, I don't remember which one of my emotes was taken down. I did have one eventually. And probably related to maybe somehow being seen as a butt. Oh, I no, I had a CJ twerk, didn't I? Oh, maybe that's on BTTV now or something else. That was directly moved, wasn't it? So that means I can put it back on Twitch now. Okay, I'll take a screenshot so I can remember that. <laughs> Look at my horse. So, there you go. Another thing, another way. Twitch kind of trying to uh, do whatever they got to do. Twitch is rebuilding the mobile app we just mentioned. There's a new home experience when you open the app. I think Frosh just said, someone just said it starts playing the stream automatically. I don't think I updated mine yet. Um, but it is going to look different for sure, and it'll probably start to look more something like TikTok interface, is my, I guess, based on the screenshots I've seen. Try to, like, build some familiarity into it. Mm -hmm. 
about time. So those are like three, four really big announcements today. Also announced one day ago. Twitch is moving away from partners getting permanent partner managers. I've had two. One died and one got laid off with the big group of everyone. I hope that got laid off. So I no longer have one. They're moving away from that anyway to a merit-based likely viewership and earnings for six month periods before review. So you will get a partnered manager if you exceed a certain revenue level basically. And I'm sure we won't know that exactly how it always been in the past is they reach out to you, you don't reach out to them kind of thing. Um, how often are partners considered to work with partner managers? Uh, partner managers review the portfolios of accounts twice each year and we aim to assign partner manager for a minimum of s period of six months. We'll periodically make it possible for you to express your interest in working with partner manager and invite you when you're eligible to participate. So, there you go. Um, back when you couldn't apply to be a partner necessarily, or you could, but it was really hard, you would automatically get a manager because there were not very many partnered streamers. I think right now there's like three or four times as many. Uh, I'd have to double check. It might be above 60,000, around 60,000 now, I think. Um, and that's up from like 20, 25K, like a long time ago, when uh, I started. So it's, it's going up. And of course, hundreds Hundreds of thousands, 300,000, maybe more uh, affiliate accounts, because it's, it's really easy to get that. Just open up browser tabs. Anyone can get that. So no managers for that. I'm definitely a bit tired, follow. That was a long day either way. I probably went to bed at 3 a.m. Something like that. Alright, I woke up at like 6 a.m. I guess. And then went back to bed. Anyways. That's pretty big news. Huge changes, right? <clears throat> we're, we're seeing different kinds of changes, but also very drastic pivoting changes this year from Twitch compared to the last seven years. So like up until maybe two years ago, um, the Twitch angle is just to keep coming out with new features. More features, more features, more features, more features, more features. And now it's sort of cutting them all off cut off all the features and be a lot more 
strict and smart with managing the, the flow, I guess. So, um, that's, that's a big deal for partners who have already been around for a long time because it'll, uh, it'll affect their income and affect what they have to do and hopefully adapt so that they can survive the changes, basically. It's a monumental flip of the platform, basically. So everyone's gonna like be feeling some pressure or stress as things change for sure until things level out, I guess. Uh, Twitch relaunched. I don't know why they say relaunched, but added channels and features for partners on the partner Discord. I think I've been in it. I never really use it. Don't really need to like. Never felt the need to to use it. Um, I think it's more for like newbies who have kind of a basic question. But a lot of partners didn't know that existed, so um, it's very easy just to automatically get partner now. And you, you don't know about these other tools that we have, so Discord has always been one of them. But yeah, I don't know. It's just to make you feel cool in the end of the day. Uh, oh, we had a question yesterday about username recycling and when the names will free up. And it looks like something changed. I think I responded incorrectly. They, they're like changing again what's going on. They uh, removed a section about recycling inactive usernames in the help article. So it's possible they won't ever release inactive account names for the foreseeable future until they change it again. <clears throat> it is uh, kind of the hot take on it. So there you go. It was like five, six pretty big things. Along with GTA 6, which of course will be huge because that's such a, a staple for communities and RP in particular. In gaming news, Nebraska released today in Trucksim. Wait, what does that mean? Trucks in Nebraska, so you can drive around Nebraska. Is that what you're saying? How how exciting! <laughs> Can't say I've been to Nebraska. go. It's already 12. I might have a GTL at 2. I do need to fill up on calories. Um, you can either uh, grab a breakfast bagel first or go to the cat cafe first how many calories I aim for anything more than zero not counting don't care I just don't want to skip breakfast and lunch for the sake of streaming and everyone always does and I always do too because it's like we don't want to eat while we're streaming or I'm running late like you know I am today because we streamed 13 hours yesterday like when do I get a chance to eat there's just no opportunity so 
then you become a skinny bee. <laughs> so it's, it's not even about calorie counting, it's just always eating as much as you can, every chance you can. Then you'll be okay. You cannot eat too much, it's impossible. There's no way to get fat when you're doing what I'm doing. Unless we're like specifically trying to eat donuts and cake all day, I guess. Plus it affects my my mood and my energy on the stream. I get very lethargic and can't can't speak anymore. You girls don't eat or poop. Speaking of 13 hours, what was that quote from the other day where someone was complaining, how do you guys stream longer than four hours? <laughs> that was 13 hours in the IRL section. So, I don't know, miss. Um, just man up and do it, I guess. Uh, this is kind of awkward timing now that rainy season is starting, so actually going out right now is a dangerous idea. Uh, there's a good chance we could be caught in it because uh, a couple things I want to do, especially if we go to Cat Cafe, might not make back at home. So I should try to bring some amount of rain gear just in case. From now on, basically, it's fine. I just got to remember it. I think in most situations, the rain hits so hard and so dramatically. There's no raincoat that's going to save you. You just got to get into cover. So it's very likely uh, you'll get stranded um, if you're caught out there somewhere. I don't want my camera to get wet, obviously. So there, I have a raincoat for my selfie stick and a big umbrella. That knocking noise is annoying, isn't it? I need to bring water. Carry a blow up raft with you. People say it floods. Um, I don't know how much, though, compared to Bangkok. I bet it floods pretty good where we're going now in Tao Dinh, even though it's like the, quote, rich area. The streets over there look like they, they can't handle it. Anyways. Just uh, put on some shoes. I'll switch to some clips just for uh, two more. Rain, kind of like I said, might happen to us. You can't hear me. Hello. I just pulled out your raincoat. Why would I look bad? 
Why would it happen? They were just chilling, I thought. It's just my seven year streamer anniversary. Momo and Anna are... Momo and... Who the fuck are Momo and Anna? What? No Momo. Anna? That's not a good name. Obviously, you just made that up. Are you gonna meet up with Sunny? Who's Sunny? No, I'm going to Thailand. I'm not meeting up with nobody. My memory's a little bit vague, to be honest. Okay. What's your telegram? Telegram. Son, I am not downloading telegram. I thought only Russians and scammers use Telegram. Rob, nothing happened last night. Rob, nothing. Where did you guys learn how to type? You guys need to take the typing test with me in practice.
I guess. last night. Belvedere was when the training wheels came off. <laughs> Belvedere was when I started pulling from my Hewlett Packard 401k. Oh come. There goes the retirement boys. There goes the pension. It was a celebration. I only do that once a year. Don't get used to it. There's a man in the ground. Works for the company that runs our stream internet. That went down three times yesterday because of the rain. at two. Do we have time to go to the cat cafe? Maybe. Yes. Either before or after. I think so. I'll try not to take too long. My, my stomach just hurt a little bit. Hi. I have the New York Deli with sesame bagels and uh, cold brew. Yes. Okay. I was loving the DJTS I found. Oh, on my balcony. Watch the 10 hours VOD. Yeah, I just unpublished it because I wasn't sure if anything bad happened. This is not a Netflix stream. This is called a live stream. If you weren't there, 
then you missed out, all right? Ten hours, oh my god. Well, no, the, well, yeah. Well, there's four VODs from yesterday because the internet went out three times. So it was actually 13 hours plus. Oh, are you watching it? Oh. Um, well, I can bring it back once it's edited, maybe, I think. I just need to skim it first, if that's okay. I do this a lot, though. If there's ever a stream where there's, like, belligerent drinking, I usually delete it afterwards, because nothing good comes from keeping that video. Don't need to. I, I don't know. I mean, I just woke up. I have to review it first. I'm not gonna let the internet review it before I review it. <laughs> I can put a unpublished or a, a hidden YouTube link. I can upload it, but it'll be unlisted. That's the word. Unlisted YouTube video. Linked on tier two shows. <laughs> Every VOD goes on YouTube anyway. I'm really fast about it. Yesterday's is already there. Oh, I mean, not the 13 hour one, but the one for the Nothing bad happened, you think? You think? Yeah, that's, that's why I gotta double check. Like, when I went to the bathroom and people were holding my camera and talking on chat, like, I don't know what was going on, so I need to review that myself, just in case. Because I was not there, and I'm responsible for it, whether I'm there or not. They were actually well behaved, were they? They seem pretty nice overall, I guess. Oh uh, yeah, that's fine. Thanks. They they seem like really normal, right? And not like. Thanks. Oh, that's fine. It's not like uh, some places. I don't know if I want to make the comparison or not, but you probably know what I mean. Like creepy or just like really weird or anything. Just like normal. Subscribe for yeah. free with Twitch Prime. probably muted because of the music. What is? There were some muted sections, but I normally cut those out when I put them to the YouTube archive. Someone say cock? No. 
I'm worried about people like flashing the camera or something. It wouldn't be the first time. Oh, are you talking about that chick? Got like sweater and pants. Yeah, she's probably a little bit warm. They'll do anything to not have the sun touch their skin. I'm sure she is uh, hot like that. But yeah, that's not pretty fun. People here aren't really dancers though, are they? Like there are dancers, but people don't dance. Yeah, I guess so, man. I streamed all the way home, so. People aren't dancers, but the girls on the stage dance well. They're very good. Yeah. They know how to dance. That's true. My body way too stiff. I can't move like that. Too much sitting up at the computer playing World Warcraft. Catch you on the weekend stream, Fire and Dub. Tomorrow is just a uh, early morning stream only. So I gotta make sure to get to bed early. Looks like we'll have about one hour for the cat cafe. We need a little bit less. Then I'll either walk or ride to a GTL appointment. Then we go to the phone store. Then we work on the stream setup. So we gotta go shopping for tinfoil at the mall here. Still alive. We'll continue with workout stream and keep going. We'll see. I'll start streaming from Thailand on Sunday.
Crazy towns in here. Did I post go live? I think I did it everywhere but Facebook. I can't log in for some reason. Six dollars. Bots on Twitter are bad. Oh my.
I don't know if you've been back here. Kevin Lentz. Okay. I'll see one. I'm just head of the cat cafe. Boning. That's what we had uh, the other night on the stream. That one looking a little bit more fancy. But basically the same thing. Gotta head out. Alright. I have to walk past the on um, the main market. Not left. Maybe the cat cafes around there. It feels like a Friday. But, oh my God. 
tell me you're rich without telling me you're rich. Two-tone SUV Maybach. The freaking what the freak, bro? Sheesh. The Maybach. Don't touch the Maybach. Check out the wheels though. Maybach music. GLS 600 Maybach. Okay, apparently I'm the only one that, that cares about Maybach. Bye Maybach. Yeah. Do we turn here? Oh, I'm not even there yet. Wouldn't know what a Maybach was. If you didn't watch me. I think that's why I react to them because they're so uncommon. It's it's almost strange that that's like the luxury choice out here. Like every country has its own like status vehicle. What they think is a measure of their success. So, like in Korea, there's some really high-end Hyundais that you don't get anywhere else. They don't send them to America. And they're really damn nice. Like a, kind of like a high-end BMW. For whatever reason, over here it's Maybox. And I only see them in LA when like influencers are trying to show off or something. Because nobody would realistically want or need one. They had the wealth to have one. Like, would feel like they would opt for something else. like a measure of having more money than you know what to do with. Or if you could buy that, it's like, why wouldn't you just buy a, a ghost or something like that, right? Just roll out a ghost. Maybe rolls are harder to get over here, or the pricing is kind of like screwy, so they choose that instead. Right? But like, I've never seen those in Michigan. People don't have those. Car and driver, that GLS back there is 200k in the USA. So then you gotta multiply the uh, import tax at like 300%, whatever it would be here. That's why it gets insane. So you got half a million to spend on a car, why would you pick that one?
get something less conspicuous. I mean, maybe that's why they do get them here. In a way, they are inconspicuous. Like, you guys don't notice it until I say it. It's not a Ferrari. It's not a bright colored Porsche or something, you know? A Rolls would definitely stand out more. This is the King Nico Cat Cafe. Doesn't Nico mean cat? So essentially it's the Cat Cat Cafe. Is that redundant? Take off your shoes. Wash your hands. Take off your pants and jacket. Look when I eat Oh my god! What? Galvanized bologna took four dollars and thirty-three cents. I said a hey. It's lost ketchup. Galvanized baloney? What does that mean? Is that music just because we walked by the Mexican people? <laughs> Good food around here. Normally a little pricey. It's very international. Thank you so much. Oh shit. Hello. So uh, this is this the first time? Yeah, first time. So here we start ticket. Okay. And you okay. Write one ticket, one to write a few things. Okay. And then you blow one drink and one cake. Sure. So, um, oh. you, you can drive, you got no, no time limit. Okay, okay. Uh, this one, I gotta go in like half an hour anyway. Um, can I have a, yeah, can I have a kombucha? Kombucha, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, you want sweet kombucha or sour? Um, oh, uh, what's better? Um, so, uh, the kombucha is basically sour. So, maybe, so if you want sweet, you add uh, more sugar. Oh, uh, sour then. Sour. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. 
Should I start? There's cats in here. Can you lower my volume? Okay. Oh, maybe this is them. Meow meow, catitude. Oh my god! What happened to his hair? Someone shaved that cat. <laughs> Uh, drink? Uh, what do you need? Oh, oh, this? Uh, uh, yes. I, I pick one of these too. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, so I'll bring you a regular for you instead. Or, is that a brownie? Yeah, that's a brownie. Oh, can I down instead? Okay, so you want brownie? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright, thanks. That's a snow leopard cat, that's a jungle leopard cat, and that's a cabbage head cat. And oh my, I have one of those like thousand dollar air inverter purifier things. Care. Those things are so amazing. They do a really good job at keeping the uh, cat places in the city like clean. They never smell of like litter or even cats themselves. Pedro, Pedro, Pedro. Pedro, Pedro. Hi. What? 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 Cats using cat beds? Mm -hmm. Cats just lay not in the cat bed. Or is that just the cat house? Cats don't go inside the cat house. They will make an effort to sleep on something not that you bought for them on purpose. This cat is coming to check out our stream setup. What up, bro? That's my, my umbrella bag. It's a really cool looking cat, isn't it? Wow, guys, no fight. No fighting. No fighting. A savannah? Oh, I've never seen a, a white savannah. Holy shit, what just woke up from back there, bro? It's Gandalf. Gandalf just came from the behind the air purifier. What the? Fuck off. 
think it'd be fox. Gandalf, do you let me pass? not even a cat anymore. I don't know what you would call it. This is definitely not a cat. It's like a possum or a raccoon maybe. Something like that. Yeah, the guy just jumped up here. effects of yesterday's alcohol. I'm just like getting tired all of a sudden. Is there a bathroom here? Can I use the other box? Well, what's that cat? It's got really big eyes. The cat must have had double eyelid surgery. Right, Gandalf? Did I leave a tuna sandwich in my bag? There's only an umbrella in there. I don't know why they want it. Later, Gandalf. Oh my god, there's a rat trying to get my umbrella too. Hello, little rat. Why are your legs so short? Oh. Oh. One cat per bed. You gotta go to the... Whoa. Yeah, something not right with that guy. I agree. He's, don't they normally have longer legs? He's like a wiener dog, but a sphinx cat. So confusing. Look at the eyes on this one, the orange one. Huge eyes. Oh my god. Like bugging out. Alien. Come here. Stretchy, stretch, stretch. Hi, I'm a cat. Is not a bed, but it is now. See, you have you have your own bed. You don't need to lay on that. That's what I'm trying to say. They don't sleep on what they're supposed to sleep on. Get them, Gandalf. Wait, no, not you too. Gandalf, Gandalf, stop that. You're taking it away from me. I need that back. Gandalf, give me my, 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 my,
That's mine. Give me. Give me. Get off. Come on. Oh, cat hair all over it. Now look what you did. Now I gotta wash my bag. Why would you do that? Go back behind the air purifier where you... Oh. Oh, yes, thanks. Don't you bite the HDMI cable. You have no idea how hard it is to find those. This guy just watching what's going on. That cat was freaking out, yeah. It started tweaking. My stomach's not so hot from last night. And Gio. I can't help it. Here's a new guy. That is the most basic cat I've ever seen in my whole life. I'm basic. His name is Basic. These are... Wow! These savannas always have a lot of energy, don't they? They like to run around and I'm like... Fucking really high. Not really. Oh, maybe only sometimes then. <clears throat> Something about cat hotel and grooming. Maybe that's upstairs. Pets in this neighborhood are very expensive. You can buy dogs down the street for $15,000. Hey, was that you? I might have to do the gym off stream, so yeah, I'm gonna go. Maybe I have to skip. We'll see. Still do GTL here and hit up a couple stores we're gonna go to. Forget your cat brownie.
cat rules. Wash your hands. Do not arbitrarily pick up or hold them. Feel free to take a picture, but no flash, please. Please give them cat food only. Be gentle. Do not disturb them. They will be very sleepy. No megaphone. I think there's a cat inside that blanket. Did you know he crawled in there? The hairless one's inside there. Maybe he needs a blanket. to go in 15 minutes. Probably should get some water, huh? Let's see what the source. I'm I'm actually kind of dying. Now. Do we pass a grocery store? Let's see how far my GTL clinic is. I'm gonna try to walk 750. Wait, no, that's the wrong place. Uh, that's the mini golf. Mm, everywhere has the same name. What is it? Yeah, that's it. Point two kilometers. <sighs> I'm going to taxi. What a wolf game. Do they charge extra because there's cats? Um, yeah, they, they do, yeah. You have to buy a ticket. Like six dollars, I think. You're back. Oh, I got some Doraemon books you can read. Looks like most of it's in Viet. A couple of Korean books.
saying that scratch post has been shredded. Someone's got some big claws. Like the fat cat on the white box. He's probably the most chill one here. head. Probably spook it. It's definitely going to jump up if I touch him. Come here. Come on. Looks like they're all sleeping now. I don't blame them. It's the cat afternoon. Cat afternoon now. It's bad. Yeah, that that white spotted one there is my favorite too. It'd be cool to have those two as a pair, though. It'd be pretty sweet. I'm more interested in this fancy LG air cleaner. Seen them a lot at like expos, but you never see it anyone actually get one because they're so insane. What up, Blackberry ST? Hi, I remember your username. You want to lock me up in there? Uh, that's only for tier 3 subs. Tier 3 sub fantasy. I'll let me do that. Can I take a cat nap? Get it? <laughs> uh, whoa! Fatty jumped way up there. How did you do that? You're too fat for that. That's 
the new one. Oh, he came over for the litter box. all the dander in there. Pull that machine. Well, those two sections are just dot giant air filters sucking in the air and then blowing it back out the top. Gotta head out. Have a good day. Get some rest. Thanks, man. Peace out, bro. Everyone's heading out. I guess it's that time. Time for people to go to work. Was that? Oh, is that the stream loop sound? Must have been. Mm-hmm. Yes, you can still have a dancing hot dog. I believe that's from being a stream loop. redeem like 30 reactions something like that pop up on the screen have audio I haven't seen one in a long time yeah I think it was just Sammy and one other person and Sammy is on the boat so she doesn't even have internet to watch the stream so I don't think there's anyone left to uh, trigger them Find good gyms in Saigon. Yeah, but I'm not able to find good gyms that I can get to because I don't have a vehicle. So it's tough for me. Some that are just way too busy and good ones. It all depends. Streamed at the gym yesterday. I was I was gonna do it today, but uh, it's, it's not gonna happen now. Maybe tomorrow, cause I got a shift from my schedule. Again. And I definitely will. Well, in Bangkok, most likely. Most likely at Muscle Factory. Whoa. Streamlift subscriber.
just for the twerking hot dog. Oh yeah. <laughs> Heck yeah. Twerking hot dog in a cat cafe. Do cats eat hot dogs? That's a nice cat down there. I should probably show you. Because we have like five minutes. I'm just being lazy and hungover now. There's a streamer who was in Vietnam and ropes and recommends a scooter rental place if you care to know. Uh, thanks. Yeah, I'm not ready to get one yet. Need to reevaluate finances first. Figure out. So I know where I'm living. Hey, yeah, the cat walked out, so I'm gonna show that one. Show a different one then. Put my fanny back. Use your new power sparingly. Oh, that was another one, wasn't it? I don't know what all the animations are based on the sounds. There's a, there's a bunch of them. New legendary has been obtained. Did you craft one? Someone must have crafted it. You got a decent nuts, but I'll probably break it down and grab something. Yeah, for sure. I, plus, I'm adding like 15 cards before we go to Thailand. So I came up with new ideas. Oh, hello. Cat in a blanket. It's zippered up. You crawl through there. I guess they like that. Oh! Oh, you got card packs when you subscribed too? Oh, shit! Sweet, I didn't know that. I think you're only the third person ever in history to subscribe, so I had no idea. Oh. Mm. oh, that's a pretty good deal then. Got, uh, I wrote them down somewhere. A few new legendary card ideas. Oh no, there's a dog outside. What are the cats gonna do? Thank God they don't know this. Going up to the cat cafe with a dog. Oh. Sounds like a big no no to me.
nobody respond to my messages today. People busy or something? if there's any scooters in the area. Phone tower right on that building. Must have some good signal in here. Looks like it. Oh my god. Carrying your dogs to the cat cafe? Big mistake. Dogs out. Cats in. Okay, I'm calling my driver. They stole a cat. Those were dogs in their hands. They're carrying their dogs. By Gandalf. By... I didn't give you a name yet. By snow leopard, by jungle leopard. Oh. Alright. Okay. Alright, see you later. Bye. Yeah, bye. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. Oh, my driver here is fast. Is that him right there? It says Lala move. I'm a dude, he's a dude, she's a dude, we're all dudes, hey. a word I'm not allowed to say on Twitch. Under perpetual construction. Perpetual construction plus pandemic bounce back. I've heard from some people that used to enjoy living in places like Da Nang that uh, there's just nobody there anymore. It's really boring compared to five years ago. And all the businesses are changing. They come back, I guess. 
My driver is just sitting here. Living in Adana. Uh, it's kind of like the same feeling I have going back to Taiwan. And maybe that's why I can't live there anymore. Same reason why they can't live in Danang anymore. Because it's like you spend so much time and love a place so much, and then you go back and it's just not the same anymore that you'd like, rather go somewhere else. Well, apparently it's a digital nomad dream that is empty and not as affluent as it was before the pandemic, but same as here. That's why there's construction. Are you, I'm gonna ask him, are you coming? Now he's coming. coming after I ask. Going too far. Just around the block. Me three. Let's let's go. Where do you want to go?
kamay mo, kamay mo. Thank you. Have a good day. So, I'm gonna go in a room with a nurse. And I'm gonna leave you somewhere outside the room. Probably in the lobby. It will take me about 15 minutes, and after that, I gotta go shopping for tinfoil. And uh, polish up the camera setup. Grab some slippies. Hi, how are you? Okay. I guess I can leave it here, maybe. I need tin foil to f fix up HDMI plug. Here's uh, what I'm doing. been a while? Yes. It's been a few months? Yes. <laughs> two? Mm. Uh, so after this, two more? Oh, you're saying it's been two months? Yeah. yeah. You have Russian, right? Yeah, I have my back. Yeah. I will turn off my speaker. <laughs> Too late. We got the purple drink. Purple. Purple life. Ooh. Okay. They are bringing me some yogurt. Yeah, yeah, I'll Thank have you. some. I think the, the man was getting one. He came over and asked. Yes. Oh, okay. Yogurt bonus. Woo! There is different staff in here than two months ago. Maybe it's a day shift. I don't usually come here in the daytime. It was just nearby the cat cafe, so I figured, why not? Hi, Jay? Jay? Who's Jay? Oh, Jay Streasy? Great guy. X. Saigon is Saigon. It's warm. 
trying not to get caught in the rain in a minute here. Wow, this is amazing stuff. I don't know who makes this, but it's so good. Looks like I'm eating baby food. I'm just frozen yogurt. I'll be in Bangkok too. In a day and a half. You want to know more about the original IRL streaming equipment? Okay. Like the Samsung S7 Edge phone and Bitstream app. That would be original, original. Maybe that goes too far back. Back to the super early days. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we uh, came up with the software and stuff before solutions existed. Came out with the hardware choices and options and cameras. With a little help from a couple of people too, of course. But there's, I was gonna say better, not necessarily better, but newer stuff, just different stuff. So I'm like, I'm going to be using a, a newer setup in Thailand the next week. I'm not going to bring this one because I don't want to risk something happening to it. It's too expensive to lose. But yeah, I'm still using one of the fairly, yeah, I'd say OG setups since forever, because it just works. But I could build something technically more powerful than what it is. It just would be different form factor, completely different parts, but also you probably need a backpack for that kind of thing, and I don't always want a backpack, sometimes okay, but not here. I mean, even last night, I can't imagine just, like, being one of those streamers with a huge backpack in a bar or something. Like, it's so, so much, so awkward, so over the top, and looks so stupid. It's just not the right tool.
tool. You need the right tool for the right situation, as they say. So you have like four setups for different situations. Unless you just want a phone stream like most chicks anyway, which is obviously the most simple thing. But phones are usually kind of scuffed. But we still have to use phone sometimes. Like, my setup doesn't... Actually, thanks for reminding me, because we need to go to the mall now to get some tinfoil. To, uh, build a setup right now. the nearest mall. I... Ooh. We walked right by the grocery store and should have picked up the tinfoil. How far is that? 900 meters. Oh. I don't know if I can walk that far today. And what if they don't sell it? They have to sell it, right? Such a waste of money calling taxis for these short trips. I'll try to walk it. They don't sell it there. I'll have to go to a bigger mall market. I think there's like two between here and my apartment. So we'll search and take that back and start building away and hopefully it won't rain before we get there. Yeah, I'll try.
that way and left. All right. Like Americans probably asleep by now. Oh, it's two forty-three here. Did uh, the lady talk to you while I was gone? She asked if I was a YouTuber when she came back. I don't know how she figured that out. Other than the giant selfies did. She would have had to come over here to see it. Maybe she saw me take my shoes off. Not a peep? Really? Oh. They must have been gossiping between themselves then. here still opens or not. I haven't been back. She said two months. Only two months? Huh? I stopped coming here when we started doing all the travel to uh, other cities here and whatnot. that a little wrong. Oh, this place closed. It says for rent. Streamer Studio. Let's go. I'm down for the Streamer Studio idea again. It's like kickboxing studio. There you go. Holy house, Jesus, Batman. I think Batman lives here. You think that door is heavy? I bet it opens automatically. Christ Almighty. wanted to eat here. Looks really neat at night. It's all lit up red. Cool. Very fancy. 
Here's a swimming pool dining as well. Also very fancy, isn't it? I can't even see it right now. I'm going through this door. under construction. Big pool though. See what a home here looks like? There you are. <laughs> that one seems small compared to the other ones.
Preschools over here. Tons of private schools. Fifty five AM there. Twelve hours. market there but it just looks like driving it himself. Imagine not having a driver when you have a Maybach. <laughs> you need breakfast and Red Bull? At that time, yes. Yes, indeed. <laughs> but it's going to rain any second. see it in the air. Well, maybe 
that's just the sweat in my eyes. Oh. the Friday afternoon rush hour. to the Cowdy neighborhood, the stock which you need. Pretty good store. Easy life living over here. Is this it? Why is there men's underwear right above the Reynolds rep? <laughs> Papel Aluminio. Papel. 30% thicker? That's what she said. You know, the cheapest one you get. Alright. It's hard not to leave here without buying more stuff. You can use a lot of these things. Try to resist. Gatorade? 
I've never seen Gatorade here ever. What's with those bottles? Why do they look so weird? Oh my god. It's like two dollars and ten cents or so for one Gatorade. I guess that's not too bad. Wow. I'm really surprised. Santa Claus Coke? I feel like their inventory here is like dating. What's the shelf like? Probably don't buy that too often though. And uh, yeah. yep, yep, yep. Oh, it's 36? Oh, well, I got a one. Thanks. Okay, thanks. I've never seen it this busy, ever. Normally this neighborhood is like the most boring, nobody anywhere place. Turns out people have to go to work, I guess. You don't see people hanging out with daytime. Usually there's never any cars down here. And just like a couple of bikes. So different. This 
is where we come for like salsa supplies and tortillas. I only come here like every Sunday. Yep. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Oh shit! Oh shit! I don't know if I can help with that one. That bike actually shattered into a thousand pieces. Good? Yeah. already helping with it. So I think it's okay. Kind of reminds me of Bangkok now. It always gets really crazy really early on Fridays before the weekend starts. It has the biggest traffic jams. Friday afternoon. I need to go to the phone store. Oh, 
man. Have a good day. Sounds good. I'm gonna keep going just because I have stuff I need to do. Only a morning train tomorrow though. It's the next morning I'll be up very, very early. Arriving in Thailand in the morning. not open tomorrow, but let me double check. I just don't want to go there right now and get caught in the rain. I'm going to have to risk it. Holy shit, it's only three? Yeah, this is crazy. Wow. Open on Saturdays. Well, I'm just 
being lazy because I feel hungover. Ah, uh, we'll go. We'll go anyway. Uh, I gotta get my passport, so... I will be back. So I can just leave you here. I'll go get it. So I'm just gonna come right back down. There's ants all over there. Crazy traffic going that direction. how much Did you go into Bangkok? Is it best to go to tier two? Or do bits gift subs? Um, bits are the most straightforward thing. You never know someone's like sub cuts. Subscription cut will depend on will depend on which contract they have, of which there's like three. I'm 70-30 now. That'll probably change after this month. I'm gonna go down a bracket. So it'll be even less. And then it uh, depends which currency it's coming from, which country. So the amount may be more or less depending on which country the subscription or gift sub is from. Bits and 
credit card donuts are always the most direct. Can you go up and brag? Have you had more tier two or do they want more tier three? Or number two? Um, that actually doesn't matter, but I mean, it is, it is of course more support. Subscribing at tier three is the same as supporting from three tier ones. So it's definitely more support. And obviously it's recur recurring, so you don't have to think about it. But the only way to go up a bracket is to have individual paid subscriptions. The level doesn't matter. So you're gonna need like 350 paid subs that does not include Prime. Prime subs do not count. Tiers don't matter towards that. The tiers used to matter for unlocking emotes, emote slots, because the higher tiers give you extra points for those slots. But that doesn't matter as much anymore because Twitch just gave us all the slots without even asking at this point. They just keep giving us more and more and more and more. It used to be a prestige thing. It was much more prestigious to have more emote slots. But uh, especially now that anyone can be an affiliate and upload their own emotes without actually being a streamer, you get people like uploading their own knockoff emotes. So, like, it's not really special anymore. Plus you got VTDV, Franker Faces, and 7TV. It's either crypto, credit card, street elements pay, or PayPal if you really want to. Subs, though, are, of course, still important because they're a measure of whether or not you're going to be able to buy your groceries for the next month, right? So, like, you can kind of gauge, predict a little bit your stability or lack thereof.
right there. The blue store. Doing okay. I've actually done a lot. Went over a whole lot of new switch changes and updates. Got a New York style bagel. Went to a cat cafe. Played with some cats. Then I went to my GTF clinic. Set up. Now I'm coming to the phone store to fix the SIM card. Have a good time last night? Yeah, it was okay. Which is a very long stream. It's over 13 hours, so I'm tired to go. You're on the East Coast? I always thought EU because of the time zone. Some of you guys wake up crazy early, man. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, the insomnia. You and me both then. Yeah, most nice. Oh, is she a Ravens fan? Is that where it comes from? SIM card expiring. Top up that much, and then I'm gonna get a uh, six month. Yeah. Someone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'll, I'll top up this first. Yeah. This has calling, right? Oh, wait. Do I have any more expire soon or no? Do I have more? If you want more, No, I, I don't need more. I, mean, I have other SIM cards. I have more than one SIM card, and I'm not sure if they're all expiring or just this one. Do you 
remember? Mm, I would have to go check because uh, I don't remember. Um, if we I have so many SIM cards, I can't keep them all straight. Um, are we even on full data right now? Let me check. Uh, it's okay, I'll probably just do this one. I'll just top up this one, uh, 900. Yeah. Well, I'll just do the top up. I'll do the. I'll get the six months after. Uh, um. No, I'm. I'm just gonna top up now, and then I don't know. This this salesperson wanted to do the package for me. Or, um, I'm just going to top up now and then I'll buy the package later. Okay. I'm going to top up 960 and then buy the six months. Yeah, see, they they want to do the uh, register. They just tell me to come here to top up. It was a uh, VPT staff that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, can I do credit card for that? How is the phone working if it's expired? <laughs> All those SIM cards are running. I think I have two in this phone and one in that phone. Oh, whoa, what the hell? Oh shit, Chow's getting attacked by bots right now. Uh, being follow potted right now by random letters. I know. I have six, seven, eight, nine SIM cards or something, and now I'm so confused. Some of them are registered for a year, some of them I was going month to month. Apparently, the one I had was three months. Now I'm registering one for six months. I don't know why, because it's working. I don't know. 
You don't see them? Yeah, I, I turned off follower alerts in the chat, but it would have just spammed the heck out of the chat if it was on. A lot of streamers use that. I'm using an app that shows an event list, so it just shows alerts for, for followers right now. So if you check the page, it says 70.2k followers now, so it was at like 68. So it just got plotted like 2k followers or something. Your M.2 arrived from here. Nine cards is excessive. Um, well, hmm. You're right, I can probably get away less now. Maybe, maybe not. Like you can, but it's not going to be as reliable. There, there will be situations where the stream is going to just not work. For no reason, you're gonna be like, what's going on? I might downsize eventually. Like maybe six months from now. After I've lived here for a year, I might start downsizing. It just depends. Because, uh, like, it's hard for me to get the 500 gig a month cards. I need a local person to do that for me. And I have one. But before that, I could only get access to the six gigabyte a day cards. So I had to buy a whole bunch of them. Because you burn through six gigs in two hours with your live stream. So we streamed 13 hours yesterday. So I need a whole lot of cards. 
How did we stream 13 hours on 68 hours? That's all I'm thinking about. At, uh, like a 4K bit rate. I have to check the charts again. I'm waiting here while I'm getting the agent to work on something just before I leave. Make sure everything's good. But check my spreadsheet. So it depends on like what bit rate we're using. Because that will affect data usage, but the camera's on six. So four K. So, uh, with these SIM cards, I would not be able to do a 24 hour search. I would reach 6 gigs of data after maybe 15 hours, assuming it was split evenly. So, uh, I did 13 hours. You know, I'm not at the cap yet for the day, but getting there. With a 500 gig a month card, you have enough, but uh, you don't always have the throughput. Kind of like unnecessary min maxing for these days. At this point, the setup is like overkill. Like, what? Why do you need like extreme reliability unless you have a thousand viewers plus, right? With less people, you can get away with lesser inferior setups. People understand if it doesn't work. It doesn't work. So, in Thailand, I'll buy one SIM card for the camera. Um, maybe just one SIM card to split between my two phones. I could do the same thing here, but if the speed is slow, it's going to mess up. If there's an outage with that one provider, it's going to mess up. Oh.
my chat phone here just really loaded SIM card. For this one has just been adjusted. I need to put that back in this one. Yeah, well this this setup is running on an older encoding too, so it's gonna drop anyway. The, the other setup could survive, but you need a backpack to carry it around. I'm not a freaking news crew, so I don't wanna do that too many times. Alright, we're done here. Now I gotta go buy water. I also see drop to clips all the time, depending on, oh, for other streams. And those guys are usually using like X265 and SRT, like better encoding than I am right now. And it still drops. Depends on the country. Like a phone stream will never work in the US. It just never will. Set six months loaded up. It was basically a million dong. So sixty, sixty-five dollars or something. I just found for it. What does that mean? Where's my backpack this time? Good to go. Thanks. Yes, it
with the stream with subscription reactions, do I know how to fix that? Yeah. I could have the audio play through the OBS and then not come through my speaker if you want. And you'll hear it without the delay as it happens on the screen. But if you do want me to hear it, then I have to mute it through OBS and just play it through my speaker and it'll be 12 seconds delay. Can you make it quieter on your end and play louder for audience? Um, hmm. Let me check. turn down my speaker, would it be quieter for me? So like, I have it up, I have it down. I'm always changing it throughout the day, right? I think it's probably normally quieter through my speaker for you, because the microphone's on me, it's not next to the speaker. I could try that. So I'll add the string loose audio to OBS and it'll play there louder. And then it'll play through my speaker to set whatever it is. I can try it out. Oh, see, come around, he goes, turn around. Um, I basically have a tenth of a second where I see it coming because it's buffering in the network data, right? Like, it's gonna, it's not gonna load instantly because the networks here are not instant. That's the only way I know it's coming. It's still trying to load. I only know it's coming when I see the bot type it in the chat. Actually, those sound alerts, those reactions, I don't think they 
trigger a bot alert in the chat, do they? So, I don't see it coming at all. That's why I'm always like, is that a twerking hot dog? Like, what's happening? I can't see what's going on. <laughs> yeah, here. Okay. Yeah, thanks. Come on. Yeah, yeah. I guess that's the... Is there a way I can update that? I don't know. That's probably the only thing, the only tool the viewers have that will actually surprise me because I don't have a heads up. Better have sound over OBS because you won't know half the time what these things are based on the sound. Okay, I'll, I'll add it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think anyone's gonna have music because not many people know about it yet. I'll start promoting it more. So I'm buying a salad. Oh, I mean, I'm not. I'm not worried about abuse. I mean, I. I wish things. A lot of the time, I wish things were more crazy, like they they were before, like. I'm not encouraging people to be less involved or who would want that. Just people, the viewers that are left aren't like that anymore. More respectable. Well, it's like, okay, I'm, I'm outside with Tao and we're like doing something kind of gnarly. Like, Sometimes I wish it was a little bit more, more crazy. We just feel like we're talking to ourselves at the time. I mean, with that subscription, you're, you're limited. Right? At least I, I thought it was a limited. That was like 30 or something. There's no limit? Really? There's gotta be at least some kind of like cooldown, right? Is there no cooldown? Uh, no. I gotta look up how that works. Huh? Sixty seconds. It's really short, man. Huh. I'll just leave it there. Like we both just said, it's not, not really a problem. <laughs> Have 
Have you heard from Baby Shoe lately? No. Probably haven't spoken in six years, man. <laughs> I forgot I turned my speaker off. I never turned it back on. That was coming out of my phone. You get 50? Oh, whoa. Oh, well, that's, that's way more than I thought. Maybe we can set that now? I don't think we could before, though. That's all Gucci, then. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty good. I wonder if I can add custom ones. That's what I should look up. They've been ex expanding the features of that a lot lately, so I should see maybe it's kind of new now. for the cat cafe. Uh, time to go. Uh, it was about three hours ago. But I understand. Time zones are hard now. Sorry. Um, East Coast got sacrificed today because of 13 hours from yesterday. But I'll be on super early tomorrow morning for East Coast. You and Baby Shrimp so good together? Yeah, that was good when we did it, but that was seven years ago, too. Get the body back to normal. So I got some chips. Mm. These taste interesting. Mm. Definitely taste like corn. They look like Doritos. Well done for getting out. Certainly been hard to lately. I usually feel like if I'm starting the stream at 11 a.m., it's too late in the day to have a good stream. So sometimes I just don't. I 
but today I had stuff to do anyway. Where's that tin foil? Rupees or ruffles? They don't have ruffles chips here. I miss ruffles. And I miss the blue Kelby chips from Japan. I definitely got skinny fat eating those like one or two bags a day. See if I can wedge this in here. It does move a lot. Like, why are the ports so so bad? So uh, the connection is not even the outside, is it? It's inside. So maybe it didn't even need tin foil, but you could use almost anything so long as it's wedged in there. Maybe. Thin. I don't know how much to use. Oh, whoa, well, I gotta make it really small, huh? Didn't need very much. I have a giant roll of it. Something like that. just happened too much not thin enough <clears throat> it looks like I'm doing crack I guess it's better. It 
The only thing is, like, I have to take everything apart when I'm packing it, unpacking it. So, like... Well, I don't have to, but it's probably better to. That means I just uh, bring a small amount of tin foil with me in case I need to switch it or add some or whatever. Or, I don't know, <laughs> like it's stuck there now. I'm sure it'll work. I'm not gonna worry about it. I have uh, another thing that'll help too. It's just six days. We'll babysit it for six days if it's not perfect. But I think it'll actually work. The hot glue did work for some amount of time until it came off. time I'm gonna rest a little bit let you guys know what's up just hanging around my place tonight if it gets really dry the hot glue just pops off mm. yeah yeah it doesn't stick to the metal that well um I haven't raided anyone in a while. Just checking to see if maybe I can. Someone streaming in Hanoi? Hmm. Okay. I don't know them. Just following right now and raiding someone new. Their name is Alodia Marie. Hanoi last day. Hopefully get to go there soon. And check it out. Alright. There we go. Not bad. Got that done so far. More to do this evening. I'll be on Discord. See you guys in a while. Have a good rest of your Friday. Have a good weekend. And see you tomorrow morning. Bye for now.